Optimus Prime here, so it's time for another Legacy like Super Villains character free run country will take Golden Speed for all Pedro or Pina from the Shazam movie DLC part part 2. So this is Pedro everyone, yeah, one of the Shazam family. Yeah, I gotta say Pedro was really awesome in the movie, yeah. All the children they cast for that movie were amazing, yes, their characters. And yeah, I can't remember who is who played Pedro. Wish I knew who it was, yeah. So what can you do? Well he's an acrobat so he can double jump, that's pretty cool. Uh is that a baseball that you throw? What is that? I can't tell what it is. Oh, it looks like a milkshake. <laughs> okay. And he throws it as a quick shot too, just like uh, Darla did with her ice cream. Oh, oh nice, he, he barrel rolls. <laughs> That's pretty cool, didn't know he could do that. That's actually pretty nice, yeah. <laughs> Rolling. <laughs> nice. Okay, so uh, of course he does have his adult form as well, so without further ado, let's transform Pedro into his adult form. Wow, look at that. Just, just like a movie, yeah, that's pretty cool. So what can you do? Well, so unlike, um, you know, the other, you know, Shazams who have, you know, lightning, apart from Dark, which is a speedster, Pedro doesn't fire bolts of lightning, okay. He doesn't put a ground wall, so actually before he has super strength. I mean, he's a, he's a strong character in the movie, yeah. Teleports, nice, yeah. I think they all can teleport the Shazam characters, yeah. You know, who are champions, yeah. No lightning beam, okay. I guess once make the character unique, you don't want really to make them all have the same ability as Shazam. So that's fine, I guess, yeah. So, uh, and, because he, he has hyper jump, he fly. Yes, he does. That's cool. So, despite not having the lightning abilities like Shazam does, at least he can can um, fly. So that's good. Now, if you're wondering who's voice actors, unfortunately, Pedro doesn't talk in this game. I mean, the only character that talks in the DLC is, is Shazam, and that's it. Yeah. And I don't know who's bad who bad the vocal effects. I don't know who it is. It's not being confirmed. Wish I knew. Um, so yeah, and uh, if you want to help a lot, Pedro is pretty simple, just um, complete um, part two, whose mission uh, that you get where you're fighting Dr. Spahn at the carnival, the Christmas carnival, so yeah, defeat him there, and then once you complete the mission where you defeat him, uh, you can play as Pedro, or instantly Dr. Byron, if that's it, all you got to do is complete that mission, then you can play as him, so that's pretty simple, isn't it, yeah, alongside your characters, he'll be there to play as, yeah. So now we're talking about what Pedro can do in the game with voice and high unlocking. Let's take a look at his character profile and read it. Let's take a look at his normal version first, see what he can do. No way less because he's known as Pedro Pena in the first for Shazam family, so he's acrobatic can transform. So he has the same abilities on the profile as Darla, doesn't he? Target's not there, is it? You know, we can throw his milkshake. Okay. How about his other version, the adult form? No affiliation. Oh, not if I say Shazam Fab, I've got no alias because his name is Pedro Pina. So he can fly, he means electricity, toxic gas, hyper jump, super strength, smash walls, security access, teleportation, transform, and venture. Oh, yeah. Here the camera, let's take a self with Agent Smith. There he is. Hold on. There we go. Is he the only Shazam in adult form from a beard? I think he is, yeah. Am I going to pause Smith? There we go. <laughs> okay, now uh, let's read Pedro's profile. Another member of Billy Batson's new family, the shy and self-conscious teen Pedro Pina initially seems to lack the confidence he needs to stand up for himself. However, when he is spurred into action, it becomes clear that there's nothing Pedro won't do when it comes to protecting his friends, yeah. Third appeared in Flashpoint issue 1 in 2011. So that's good. I think he appeared in the same issue with Darl. I think, I, I, I think all the Shazam family does appear in my issue, don't they, I think, yeah. And he's 12 years old now, because it's 2023 now, so he's 12 years old, yeah. And of course, 8 years later, he appeared in Shazam movie, yeah. 
Doesn't mean showing you Pedro Pena finishes on on part two DLC pack in Legacy Super and so yeah, be sure to give us a do a like. Also let me know in the comments what you think of Pedro and this game you played it, I think of in general. Also be sure to subscribe to my channel for more videos coming in the future and I will see you all later.